a picture speaks a thousand words now let's see how pictorial or graphical representation of data can be done using the spreadsheet technique this is the assessment workbook i have calculated the result of all the students of my class and here is the table which gives me the summary of the result of my class as to how many students appeared and how many passed in such and such division and supplementary pass fail whatever it is the entire data has been tabulated in this form and i want to convert it into a graph so that just one glance will give me an idea of the performance of my students so if i want to represent a table in the form of a graph what i have to do is select the table if i don't want the entire data i can select the limited data like i want only up to fail then i can go to charts and there are various kinds of charts let me select a column chart from here and i want my chart to appear this way so i have to choose a chart among the inbuilt given so my graph is ready i have to make little changes according to my need in this graph see i don't want my graph to contain a few of unnecessary things uh, i want only the main result of the class see or you can see uh, this table this table contains uh, the main main result and result of the supplementary exams and the final result so what i want here is only the final result i don't want the main and supplementary separately so if i want to make changes to my graph i can edit it any time let me click on the graph and i want to make it a little bigger by dragging it so i can see very clearly i can remove any of the unnecessary parts so that my graph becomes bigger in size see this graph here uh, has the results number of students appeared uh, passed in first division second division third division see you can see three columns for each because it is one is the main result one is the supplementary result and one is the final result so i want to keep only the final result and remove these two what i have to do is right click on the graph and select the data here you can see male woman girl for school main exam result supplementary result final result I don't want this simply remove it I'm left with only two kinds of data then again I don't want the supplementary result I want only the final result so click on it and just remove it now I got a greater area for the graph so here you can see very clearly uh, appeared first second third but Uh, the legends are missing i don't know what this is appeared how much is it is it 70 or 71 not very clear so what you have to do is just go to the graph click it and go to chart layout and if i want data labels here you can see no data labels are there i can put values now it gives me very clearly that the number of students up here is 74 passed in first division is 90 but the font is too small i can't see let me select the font and i can change the font see i can make it bigger bolder again bigger and i can also change the color i can try the number of things over this so mm, whatever changes you want to make to the graph you have to click on the graph and then go to the chart layout 
and explore all these you will learn more and more what how to remove the chart title or how to insert the title what to do with x axis y axis and z axis and what are the data tables and labels and all these things and grid lines just go on exploring you will find a plenty so enjoy it have a nice time thank you